Hello there, and welcome back to Attempting to Allardyce. It has been a little while, unless you're watching these all in a row, in which case it's been a few seconds, but in reality it's been weeks, months, a couple of months. Um, reasons for this, summer, festivals, drinking, issues with PC, and laziness. There are the issues, those are the, not issues, excuses. But we're back today with a new episode, and let's have a look at the schedule. We last met here in the 2-0 win over Burnley in the Carabao Cup, uh, and I said I'd meet you back for both legs of the Manchester City uh, Carabao Cup, but I didn't, because I've, I've already played this. Uh, I can't remember when, but see it didn't go well. Before then, though, uh, a 1-1 draw away at Liverpool, good stuff. 3-1 uh, win at, away at Watford, good stuff, raffle with more goals. A 3-0 win at home against Crystal Palace, brilliant. A 2-2 draw with Fulham, uh, not the best. Um, a 1-0 win in the third round of the FA Cup against um, Nottingham Forest. Riyad Mahrez scoring in one minute and then just didn't bother after that. We then played that first leg of the Carabao Cup semi-final against Manchester City. Lost 1-0 to a Leroy Sane uh, away goal, which is shit. Then went on to improve our form massively by losing a game. Um, to two late goals against Southampton. So today what we're going to do is we're going to play Newcastle in the Premier League and then see if we can turn around that second leg um, against Manchester City. Also, you notice, we've been drawn against Manchester City in the FA Cup, so I just can we stop playing them now at any point? No, we've still got to play them later on in the season. I really just hate playing at Manchester City because they're a very good football team. Either way, let's not focus on them now. Right, right now we've got to play Newcastle. Uh, in the league, in which we are currently fifth, um, still in that top seven teams, although Chelsea are drifting slightly away uh, from sixth place, which is fun to see. Um, we've just got to keep the pressure up, keep ourselves in contention for the Champions League places, which we, which we still are at the minute, uh, and not let this slump in form um, happen. The last time I played this game, this save in particular, it was the Southampton game. And it looks like I, uh, I may have stopped because of rage after that. But here we are, we're back. First time I've touched this save in, like I say, a good few weeks. So let's play Newcastle um, today with the squad. Here it is. I don't think I need to change anything apart from maybe... Maybe? Maybe. Maybe put, just put Tete in there. Um, Rafa. Yeah, let's put Rafa in there, back from injury. Um, got Mares on the bench, that means... There we go. So, other than Madison injuring himself by lifting weights three to four weeks, we've got a fully fit team, so we're going to play a fully strength squad. Catch us, Michael, in goal. Jorge. Is it Jorge? I'm oh, sure Will's just come back from injury. I think he still needs a bit of time to recover. He may be uh, in the running for the Manchester City game. Um, but to start with today, Jorge, Mer, Benkovic, Tete, and Didi and Hendricks, that midfield two. Uh, in behind Diabate, Grealish, Rafa on the right, and feet up up front. Uh, Ibrahimovic takes the place on the bench instead of Madison because he can play an enganch um, if we really fancy that. He has got two goals this season. I guarantee they were both in the League Cup earlier on. It was penalties. I can't remember. Probably in a video somewhere. He's on the bench. Let's uh, get into it. The Newcastle team we played today looks a bit like this. That's a double egg midfield. <laughs> It's very shiny. Um, that's probably the tactic they're going for. Um, but other than that, n nothing stands out majorly. Bit in court. Some who's this guy? Mm, looks like a very defensive-minded midfielder. Other than that, yeah, should be should be a win. Although Newcastle are eighth, they probably still have Rafa Benitez in charge. Unlike in real life, that's a shame. Newcastle fans, real shame. Um, I want you to. Go and show me while we're favourites. It's an early highlight. Six minutes in. Tete is on the ball, moving forward up that right-hand side. He goes past Rafa, uh, who will probably come back um, to overlap him. No, he's going to stick with Grealish just there. Grealish brings it over towards Diabate. Good switch play. And Diabate with the first time cross into Arp, and that should be um, testing the keeper a bit more, although it is offside by the looks of it. It's a corner for us. Grealish whips it in. Arp at the back post. It's the upright. It's come back out. I did. I thought it had gone out of play, but here we go. Uh, Newcastle with a counter-attack. Can we foil this like kitchen foil? Well, Catch us, Michael ends up having to make a save. Um, the silence there was nerves. It's a free kick Rafa will take. 
Just brings it into the box. George Romero at the back post. Doesn't quite get to it, but he will get outside the box and collect it again. Ball at his feet back to Ndidi now. Ndidi back out to Rafa. He's still on that side waiting to cause havoc with a ball into the box. And Arp has scored this time. It looks like it was in off the underside of the crossbar and then off the back of the keeper's head. And it's Arp with a goal, an assist by Rafa. Good to see Arp getting more goals as his, uh, his development progresses through the season um, to become our, what should be, number one striker. So, oh, what the fuck? Did you just... I'm sorry. Wait, 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 Rafa. Excuse me, sir. Okay, so here we are. Uh, and Didi whips it out to Rafa, who takes one touch on his right to get himself ready for the cross, then runs at the ball and hits a Rabona cross directly onto the head of feet up. Rafa may be the brightest player I've ever seen in the history of Football Manager. It's a corner again. Grealish hits it in. Benkovic somehow gets to the back post unmarked with a lovely run. But his volleying skills aren't up to the mark. And we're straight into another highlight. This time, by the looks of it, for Newcastle. Shelby to Moy. The eggheads combine into Bissancourt. Back to Moy. Moy to Spinozola. And it's fallen to Diabate now. Can we get a counter-attack going? He plays it long. Um, only as far as Yedlin, because, I mean, who else was there? Shelby gets the ball back now for Newcastle. Uh, as part of the, the eggheads, uh, gives it back to... Uh, the defensive egghead. I mean, he had hair, but we're gonna we're gonna go with the egghead theme. Tete intercepts another counter, maybe this time. Hendricks with lots of time. Grealish with time. They're not really putting any pressure on yet. Uh, they're probably waiting till we get into their half, which we are now. Diabate though storms forward. Ball over the top. Arps in. Arp with the second. No, no, he's hit that straight at the keeper. Actually, here we go again. Vallejo to Bittencourt. Um, and tackle by Ndidi it's a Grealish Rafa it's really good defensive tackles we've seen today um, from our lads Rafa down the right hand side ball in to Diabate left hand a fucking absolute pile driver saved it's a throw in Tete gets it to Spin Spinozola who gets it to Mutu who gets past one but not as far as Georges Gemer Benkovic with the challenge and Mare with the sweep up it's a very good combination Hendricks now will get it back out to Diabate on that left hand side who's just had his pile driver saved into Grealish. Grealish gets into the box to Rafa. Rafa, can he turn and shoot? No, it's intercepted. Um, is that is that all we're here for? Or is there some more? Benkovic with a hopeful ball over the top. And Rafa gets to it. Of course he does. And he gets uh, tackled by Vallejo at the last second. <laughs> That's just ridiculous. So, half-time has come around. An action-packed first half uh, in, a, in an episode where we're trying to fit two uh, games into. Um... Don't get complacent out there, because it's still only 1-0. Mainly thanks to the Rathbona, um, which doesn't sound as good as I thought it would in my head. Um, let's just move on and never call it that again. A free kick for Newcastle here. Um, they take it short and play it between each other. Get it out to the right-hand side, where Fernandez, the centre-back, waits. He is tackled by Diabate, because um, he didn't really know what to do when somebody said cross to him. Just looked confused, started to make some bird noises. Diabate, by the way, has just absolutely destroyed the left-hand side of the field before anybody could even get to the box. Rafa's there now, and he scores. Tenth goal of the season for him. Uh, well deserved. So that's number two for us today. Let's not throw that away, though, as we have in the past. Very occasionally, but we have. Uh, return to the form. Diabate just absolutely... He got so far up the pitch, so quickly, there was nobody in the box. Then Rafa got the rebounds. One touch to control, one touch to finish. Uh, Dubravka had no chance. 2-0. 68 minutes have gone now. Uh, not much has happened since the goal. Uh, the Egghead midfield get back on the ball. Out to Yedlin on the right side, who's challenged brilliantly by Georges, who gets it to Hendricks. Really should have brought Chilwell on the bench so I could rest Georges, um, as he has been playing solidly for weeks now since he returned from injury. Apparently he's just got a tight hamstring. So we might have to get Johnny Evans, the Welsh weapon he scored, the next best thing we have on, on the pitch. It is a corner to us. Um, it's only gone as far as Benkovic when it's, the clearance comes. Back out to Grealish, she'll get another chance to whip it in. Vallejo clears only as far as Ndidi, who, yeah, not much, not much really, actually. Uh, but since we're here, 74 minutes in, we are going to make a couple of changes. We are going to give Georges a bit of a rest. He's uh, looking a bit worse for wear. I don't know if any of you guys can, I don't know why you're even reducing what you're doing. Um, we're just going to have to sit with Johnny Evans on the left-hand side. Uh, any other changes that we want to make? 
should probably rest some of our important players. Uh, Riyad Mahrez is going to come on because since he's on loan from Manchester City, he can't play against them, so there's no point in not bringing him on now. Um, these two have been outstanding as well, but we will just leave it at that for now. So throw in. Johnny Evans is taking. Gets it to Grealish. Touches. Oh, it's straight into Mahrez. <laughs> he just tries to get himself a goal. Um, doesn't, unfortunately. But what an introduction that would have been. Out on that side. It's cleared to Ndidi, who will bring it back. And will go again. That's what the central two do, Hendricks and Ndidi. Ndidi with the tackling. Hendricks with the interceptions. Mahrez now up. Into Hendricks. Can he get a goal? No, he hits the post. That really should have been 3-0. Game over. And in fact... Um, I've gone back in time by accident. Sorry, back to life. Make a substitution. Uh, Torreira will come on for Hendricks just because he's yellow carded. Um, and I see he's an important player for us. Not just because he missed that really simple sitter. Nothing to do with that at all. And there you have it. It's full time here at the King Power Stadium. Uh, we've won 2-0. Good, comfortable win. Um, and in fact, we will tell them all uh, a very good win indeed. Uh, Rafa... I mean, what the fuck, Rafa? You've done a Rabona, and you've assisted with it, and then you scored as well. Just everything we do comes through you. Just ah! he's too good. He's too good for his own good. Uh, the defence were also top notch today. Uh, obviously, Jorge came off uh, for a bit of a rest, but six point nine uh, would have probably got into the sevens if he'd stayed on, but did need a rest, like I say. He's already back to 74%. What a day. Johnny Evans did all right. 15 minutes at left wing back. Loves it. Loves being complete wing back to Johnny Evans. It's his new favourite thing. Um, other than that, hand over there. Done. See you at the start of the Manchester City game. Unless there's anything beforehand. Because um, we are in January. But considering we're only going to get 15% of any transfer revenue that for selling players I don't think we're going to be making any business this, this summer unless we bring in a youngster for less than £2 million so keep an eye out for that oh, Hey, hello and welcome back um, we are now moments away from the second leg of the sec yeah, the semi-final of the Carabao Cup we are 1-0 down we are away from home we have a 4-0 and loss record against Manchester City in games we've played against them so Positives. Grad Jaguar is unhappy. I, competition for places. I don't know. I don't remember. Um, we're going with the same team that started the last match. Schmeichel, Jorge, Mer, Benkovic, Tete, and Didi, Hendricks, Diabate, Grealish, Rafa, and Arp. On the bench, you'll notice uh, Barnes steps in uh, ahead of Mares, who can't play. Uh, and Ibrahimovic, who is retiring at the end of the season, so really doesn't give a shit. Um, I've also put Pereira there because he can play both winger and wing back, so cover. Chilwell's back on the bench, because Jorge might get tired. He's already a little bit tired. Um, Johnny Evans is there. Torreira's there. Eggerstein's there. We're all there. So let's play them in a game of football. Here's the team they go with. That's fucking disgusting. In our, no, he's not actually that bad. He's 17 years old. He's not bad at all. <sighs> What do we do? What are we meant to do? We got De Bruyne and Savage. I don't just pray, pray for it. We're not changing our style. We're doing what we do. Um, let's let's give these. Uh, let's. Uh, ooh, yeah. Let's uh, let's uh, let's go show everyone what we've got. I've just told them no pressure. We've already one nil down. There was no point in trying to put pressure on. Arch relaxed. He loves it. Now he's relaxed and motivated. It's a free kick. Well. It's a throw in for Manchester City. Mendy gives it to Aguero. They play it around us like they're one of the best teams in the world. Mayor heads it as far as Savic, who destroys the crossbar. Um, it, they've still got it, actually. It's still going on, and we've cleared it for now. It's another highlight. We didn't get any seconds to recover. Um, Walker's on it. Brings it inside to Vigel, to De Bruyne, De Bruyne, Savage, Sterling, Aguero, Mendy, over to Jorge, Savage, Sterling, Sterling, Sterling. That's it. Game over. Um, yep. Yeah. 
here it is. They're just playing it around us. We can't get near them. Sterling takes two touches and uh, scores. Um, it's now seven minutes. This this could be messy. Um, they have the ball. They have a goal. I don't know what to do against Man City. It's not it's not really fair. Hmm. It's another three kick for them. They've taken that one short. <sighs> I'm just going to go get a drink, actually. When did we get a penalty? Wow. When was Ndidi taking penalties? I've missed everything. Um, I don't know why. Fucking hell. A lot happened there. Uh, I don't really know what to say anymore. Because they're just going to keep doing this for the next while I mean how has he gone over him he's gone through catch a smile there <sighs> one touch and he goes he goes through him and also the three defenders. And and the game is now back to being over. We don't need to sit. Thank you. Thank you. Well. Um. That. That was. That was. Um. That was shit. Quite frankly. Yeah. What, what do we do? Let me. Let me have a look. This is what I come up with. We're going to play 4 4 fucking 2 in an attempt to score four goals. It's not going to work. Let's try it. Let's see. If, uh, well, two changes. Eggerstein's on uh, for Grealish and... Oh, was it Grealish? It was Grealish. And um, Chilwell's on for Jorge. Is he? Am I doing that? No. No? Oh, shit. Shit. Well, here, right. L look, watch this. Chilwell for dear Barre, Jorge goes up there as a defensive winger on support. Wow. Did you see that coming? No. Nobody saw that coming. And then I was just going to change these as well. Change the rolls about. They won't know what hit them. Yeah, look at that. Where's that come from? Deal with it, Man City. They will deal with it. They'll deal with it very well. We have a corner. Straight away. He's been kept out by the 17-year-old uh, Irish goalkeeper. We have a free kick. Uh, Rafa's actually, you know, in the game now, which is something. Here he is. There he is. Look at that. Fucking this should have probably started this formation. I mean, we'll play them in a few days anyway, so we'll give it a go then. What a ball that is. And he gets it back. And he's like, ah, 
Take that through the nut. Whew, what a little curl. Rappers bringing it back. Another free kick. Another goal. It's offside. Uh, it was too good to be true, wasn't it, really? How far off was he? Um, A little bit. A little bit, actually. It's another highlight. Hasn't been one for a while. Memphis Depay is playing for Manchester City. And he's on the pitch. Uh, he is tackled, though. So, that's good. Counter. Anybody? Yeah, here we go. Rafa's on the ball. That's all you need. He storms forward. Manchester defence weak at the knees. And we've missed. That's a shame. It's a throw for us in our own half. So, let's not give it away. Let's keep it easy. On the ball. On the floor. With your feet. Like football. Hendrix. Good to Rafa. Rafa. To Tete. Tete. Now. Out to Jorge. He's playing that left hand side now. Brings it. Cross. Arps there. Should have scored. Should have scored, really. Uh, four minutes to go. Um, Terrera for Hendrix. Done. And it's all over. And. We worked so hard to get through to the Carabao Cup. Uh, I just knew it was all over as soon as we were going to play Man City. Um, not good enough. Really? Let's focus on the future. We have this much Premier League to go. So, being in the Champions League race, I think we should probably focus on this. And meet back for these very similar looking badge, badges. Wolves and Bournemouth. The Bourne Wolves. The Bourne Wolves. The Wolves born. The Wolves born. Sounds like Wolves born. Sounds good to me. We'll meet back for Wolves and Bournemouth uh, next up. And see where we stand. And until then though. Thank you very much for watching. Like, share, subscribe. It's fun. It's fun. Do shit. Thank you. Bye.